Hi guys, this is me Anki Kanishka Gulan. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Well, if you are new on my channel, just do one thing. Just do subscribe my channel and also hit the notification bell icon so that whenever my new video is coming up, you will get the notification instead. So yes, uh in this video, I am going to talk about how you gonna do the anchoring in English. I got a lot of messages about this topic. Yes, Didi please tell us how we gonna start the any event in English. So it's 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 very easiest yes so in this video i'm going to share you three simple steps that you have to follow and whenever you are following these three steps you will get any other you will host any event any event any sort of event so what do you have to do just you have to be in my video and without further delay let's get started so guys here is the first step first step is the good english yes a lot of you are thinking that if we knew already english so why we are watching this video so if you knew the english basic english is required yes it's very mandatory but if we are talking about the something professional so we have to follow these simple things so i'm going to telling you here how you going to improve your english day by day and how you going to do the anchor in english so first of all you what you have to follow it you have to follow it first step that you have to start reading books whether is it novels newspapers books comics whatever whatever you got friendly so you have to start reading that whenever you are reading that books now whenever you are reading any novel whenever you are reading any newspaper so what is the things what is the thing is that that whenever you are reading so your mind and your senses is all up and on the time you have to follow these things and you have to focus on the words so whenever you are focusing on the words na so you don't need to just uh, just focus on the sentences no i'm not talking about the tenses i know about it you know what there is a time like when i was in kid so i used to follow this thing ki i i need to learn about the tenses so i'm really confused about the past tense future tense and the present tense so no i am not going to telling you to learn the tenses because whenever you are start reading the books in the with the very open minded thing so you will get automatically uh, you will automatically know about the tenses so start reading the books also start watching the english movies yes english movies so i am not talking about the content just watch the language how they are delivering it because it's a really really major point uh, see it, it's like my same thing i am not the person who knows the english very well like before 5 years true i have in some uh, videos also th so that i can share with you so after the 5 years how this gonna change because i read every day each and every day i'm following this step and this improves a lot so whenever you are start reading now it helps you a lot because i have in a one thing let me tell you one thing a good language leads to a good speech and a good speech leads to a good language vice versa whatever you gonna comfortable so first step is the very good step that you gonna follow the good english so good english ke liye what you have to do good english ke liye you have to follow the step that you have to start reading books that you have to start watching the uh, movies or any web series or whatever you makes comfortable with it so here is the first step let's come to the next yani step ki step 2 so step 2 is the content is king well you must be heard this word before content is king content is king content is king a lot of people are talking about the content is king but nobody going to explain you what is content here i'm going to tell you what is content so content is your speech content is your the way you are delivering contents with the way you are addressing your audience content the way you are observing the thing content the way you are preparing everything content the way you know about your whole event so content is the king yes first of all you should know about your event whenever you are hosting any corporates any social function whatever is it you should have the knowledge you should have the 100 percent knowledge about that event so try to get the as much as information uh, like which is possible and uh, so you have to follow this thing so content is king may what you have to do now i am going to telling you how you going to create a content a good content so i am telling you like you have to know about the your event first and second is that that you have to know about the script so whenever you are start writing any script so as i said any event in any event your first starting first minute it's a most precious time so don't waste it and don't ruin it so what do you have to do on that time you have to take any quote see uh, it's all connected whenever you are reading your books now so you will get a lot of quotations in that book so what you have to do you have to follow that thing also and uh, if if i am going to say like your event is very near and you don't have any time to read the books so what you have to do you have to follow one thing 
and you have to search on the Google uh, any quotation uh, with the, any famous author and like make a differentiate about it. Don't don't merge anything. Like if you are hosting any corporate any social events, so merge merge these quotations. No no no. If you are hosting any corporate, so try to add a motivational thing. And if you are hosting any uh, school event, so try to add any educational uh, quotations. So get that thing. Start. start with this quotation and also after that what you have to start like hello ladies and gentlemen a very very good afternoon to all of you on the behalf of this and this so and so well my name is Ankit Kanishka Gula and it gives me immense pleasure to welcoming all of you in this beautiful afternoon ladies and gentlemen without further delay let me start this beautiful beautiful afternoon with a huge round of applause so yes this is how you gonna start it yes so content is the king reason because you know you have to know the each and every second about your event if you are having three hours if you have the three hours on stage so you know about the single second that what you have to do if you got any filler if any performances get late so what you have to do how you gonna fill it that's the that's the task and that's the uh, anchor's job we gonna say it so this is how you gonna improve and also one thing content Again, I'm saying. So whenever you are reading books now, so you will get a lot of words. So, so books reading is cannot uh, help you to just improve your communication, to improve your words, improve your language. It also helps you to getting the good vocabulary. So when you have the good vocabulary, see. Let me give you example. As we are speaking Hindi in day to day our life, and everyone know the right word in the situation, but but in English. If we have the good language, if we had the good vocabulary, so we don't need to think about also. But most of the cases and most of the beginners and most of the pros also, they are still confused whenever they are having any situation and they cannot justify what should what what should I put here and what should I uh, what 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 should I particularly putting here. There's a reason because we are not so much habitual to use language, language in our day to day life. So try to whenever you are starting, whenever you are reading now, so just. grab a pencil and note it down and underline that words which is not comfortable to speaking which is not comfortable to like you didn't know about the uh, meaning of that word so whenever you are writing whenever you are just underlining that word and just try to find out the meaning and you will see automatically this will helps you a lot how this will helps you a lot because whenever you are reading first of all the benefit is that your mouth automatically flows out with the good words and uh, second you don't need to search a vocabulary because you have already a vocabulary in your mind so you don't need to have any dictionary and you don't need to find any other words from anywhere so everything is here and third thing is that because whenever you are reading so you have the perfect amount of confidence that uh, this word and how we going to pronounce it simple as that so here is the second topic here is the second step content is the king and you know the tip and you know the trick how you have to create the content so here is the step 3 that you have to follow to do anchoring in english so the step 3 is a good amount of confidence yes i am talking the good amount of confidence a lot of people know about the language but they have an over confidence i am not saying about the over confidence i am saying about the good amount of confidence yes, yes good amount of confidence is the perfect and positive thing how you gonna bring the good amount of confidence let me tell you here so you have to follow one thing whenever you are reading a book i must say again it's all connected how it's all connected because whenever you are starting any video and whenever you are just reading a book so what you have to do you have to just follow one thing getting the book stand in front of the mirror and read loud slow and loud this is the easiest concept ever yes again let me tell you again slow and loud slow and loud because whenever we are speaking slow So, so we know how to pronounce that word our pronunciation is well and good enough then we already getting the good amount of confidence so confidence is that yes it takes practice of course getting the good amount of confidence it's not something that you can get it overnight no so you have to practice each and every day start reading each and every day start watching each and every day start uh, uh, creating content each and every day so and that even the surprise lee came so what you have to do you don't need to just think about so much about it what you have to do you have to just focus one thing that i am going to hosting this event and this is how this flows this is how this thing so a good amount of confidence brings a lot of things but 
how you going to bring the good amount of confidence start reading and whenever you are reading just in stand in front of mirror uh, in my previous video i already talk about the uh, stand in front of mirror and talk to yourself and start reading on that no point so you have to follow this thing again so stand in front of mirror like this i am standing and what do you have to do take a book and start reading slow and loud slow and loud slow and loud this is the concept only this is the easiest concept ever you are focusing because i must tell you i am getting this topic i am getting this thing and i'm i, I learned this thing from my previous 7 years and uh, you know what it helps me a lot each and every day i'm following this thing sometimes my family people are saying that she's gonna mad so trust me if somebody saying you like this only so you have this kind of confidence you have this kind of belief that i am i am doing something good so that is you have to follow it also whenever you are following this thing you will have the amazing amazing event ever so just follow one thing spare one hour for reading spare one hour for the watching any movie and spare one hour to practicing and yes one more thing If you having the script, if you having the pop, proper script in your hands, na, so what you have to do? Just do do one thing: practice, practice, practice. The how many times you do practice? Like ten times, hundred times, thousand times, as much as you can do the practice, as much as you can do, as much as you can close to your successful event. So this is something how you have to do it, and also just do three steps. Simple first step is the. Good English. Second, content is king, and third is good amount of confidence. Yeah. If yeah. you are getting these three things and you are practicing each and everything, each and every day, so you must be thank me later about it because you will surely gonna improve your communication. Also, you will surely gonna improve your confidence level, and of course, you will getting the good habit to reading the books. So that's all about the video. I am much sure that you will. This video is surely gonna help you. If this video is gonna help you and this video is helpful for you, so please do let me know in the comments. And if you already want something, you want any topic and you want a video on any particular topic, just comment that video. Just comment that topic to me, and uh, I will surely try to make the video on that topic. So this is all about the video. Well, I'm much sure that this video gonna surely gonna help you. So what do you have to do? Just like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and also do share with your friends if. anyone is preparing for anchoring in english so to share with them yes see you then bye bye take care